Hello, my dear viewers. Welcome to today's coffee cup reading. This coffee cup reading is for all Libras and it's for Ke um, April 2023. I hope you'll enjoy this reading. You have a very strange cup today. A lot is happening here. So much. Um, there it is. I'll show it to you. It just looks magnificent. My dear viewers, welcome. Uh, for those of you who are new, please remember to... Um, Subscribe to the channel if you enjoy this and give me a thumbs up and do the notification bell so that it always notifies you when I upload different videos for you. Okay, uh, my dear Libras, what I would like to let you know is, uh, especially for those of you who are new, my dear viewers, uh, be mindful that I meditate prior to doing this and I'm given a lot of information which I write down on a piece of paper and deliver them to deliver them to you at the end of this reading. So stay tuned for that and let us begin without any further delay with the first thing i'm seeing here hmm, very interesting very interesting i just put my glasses on so i can see deeper i'm seeing on this right hand side which is yes i i see hmm, okay observing i see someone observing watching watching the changes the transformations looking at things perhaps looking at the sky even, looking at the moon, looking at the sun, observing, observing your life. Someone sitting there observing. There's a camera also. It's like they're looking through the lenses of camera, looking at your life, looking at the changes around you, at the universe, at the world, at the sky, watching, questioning, wondering. How amazing. Um, I am a liberal myself and I do that. So that is really quite interesting, looking at the sky and observing the, the, the sky, the sun, the moon. It's incredible. Um, but in this particular case, that was metaphorically. Some of you could be doing that. But the majority of liberals um, are trying to gain. This tells me that you're trying to gain some sort of perspective, some sort of clarity. Something isn't clear to you. Things seem to be um, not quite clear. It's like it's like there's something that's in the dark. Something you need to know. Something you want to know the answer to. But you don't have the answer. And it feels like your path is unclear. There's uncertainty. And you're searching for truth and clarity. And it looks to me like you will be getting that in due time. Because I'm seeing the light coming through and showing you illumination and showing you your path and the changes that are going to take place. There is, however, something important um, that you need to know. If you are allowing someone or something to drain your energy, you need to be aware of that because there is something that's draining you. You need to establish boundaries. You need to um, really establish boundaries and and assert yourself to follow those boundaries so that um, you protect yourself and deflect anything that is negative away from you. No matter what it is, it might be something uh, not so severe, but uh, it is draining a lot of energy out of you. So it is try to use your wisdom to transform your life by setting boundaries, even at the cost of um, what I'm doing, like me as a Libra, what I'm doing as an example. I was making these uh, readings so long that I kept on, I was always told that you're doing too much and make them shorter and shorter. And finally, I did by putting, uh, because I see too much and I get caught up and I forget about time. And then uh, I was told over and over and finally I had to put a time clock and alarm boundaries so that I stop when I have to continue and then stop again. So, uh, and this is not only for uh, for the sake of uh, being too long, but for the sake of my uh, breathing also, because it has been affected. So, yes, this is about, uh, this was just an example about establishing boundaries. So if there is something draining you, uh, try to sort of establish some sort of boundaries. Now, there is someone here, uh, someone that you've been thinking about, someone that, someone very strong, uh, they take action very quickly. They give you great results. This person is, um, you're thinking about this person or you're too afraid to talk to this person or you don't know how to converse with this person, how to reach out to this person. There is something like that. This person could be someone that you're attracted to also. It's possible. Um, 
There is a situation. Uh, so this is. It's just that it's not saying any anymore. But there is a, a disagreement. There is some sort of um, not conflict, but a cut off. Something is being cut off. There is um, there is a challenge there. Arguments, perhaps, or maybe there was a first frustration, difficult time that you are going to go through in regard to that person, and that's going to come to an end. I feel like something from the past, uh, something from the past, happy memories, good times with someone are coming back, but the universe is saying, and your guiding angels are saying, to let go and to move forward. You need to heal from the loss of this person i think you might have lost someone in the past so they're saying to to sort of release this pain that you have inside of you release it and let go and you will be healing from this loss you will heal i feel like it's going to take a little bit of time and you will heal some of you are reconciling there's reconciliation of an existing relationship things are coming back together and or for some it's a beginning of a new relationship so some of you are reconciling some of you it's the beginning of one a new relationship that's possible now so take a chance and be bold and um yes i kept on seeing that be bold over and over today in my meditation um you are very special and you are truly cherished by your guardian angels and they do care about you exceptionally you need to know that uh, and they are going to defend you and they are going to fight for you they are going to be with you and and give you all the resources you need in order to overcome uh, um, some trouble or some challenge that you are having it could be emotional it could be physical there's a conflict, setbacks in your life, and there are no easy answers. So there is, but the main thing looks to me like you have been very strong and you've been persevering, but now there is a challenge and you must overcome it and you will. You will with the help of your guardian angels. They are going to be uh, giving you all the resources and all the powerful, everything you need to overcome this challenge. And then right after that then the rewards begin there's all kinds of rewards there's information as valuable rewards for you believe it or not there is um honesty there is a start of something you're doing a new career path a new study but there is also um, a beautiful golden sort of like two golden nuggets here it looks like to me there could be some money or gift of money coming to you um I feel like there is something like a, an envelope. There is someone put, put, like holding in their hand a beautiful fish. And then there are two nuggets, not one, but two golden nuggets that, that represents money. Could be a gift, could be coming from someone. Uh, could be the person holding the fish could be just showing that you are going to be lucky. Fish is about luck. It's about abundance. Uh, but I'm also shown that you are an entrepreneur. You are capable of so much. You could actually literally have your own business and run it on your own without anyone. You are that capable. And I feel like there is teamwork also, but you might be working in a place where you are the manager and there's others helping you perhaps, even though I said that you are. Um, like I am very capable as a Libra, but I can't do this on my own. There's got to be an office running this situation and and everything else that goes with the recordings and and everything else that I'm not capable of, like um, how to put things together, videos and upload them on YouTube. I'm not able to do any of that. So the channel owners do all that. So um, there is a, there is assurance of success without a doubt for you. Dear Libra, as I was saying, there is assurance of success without a doubt for you. And... Um, and you have all the power from the universe. Your angels are watching all over you and helping you in every way. And this, they're letting me know that this is a time for success. Nothing can stand in your way. You will be acknowledged for your efforts. You will be rewarded and you deserve it. Keep moving forward and you will be doing fantastic. You have to have faith and believe. Don't lose your faith, whatever you do, because you are guarded by these incredible angels. They're all over your cup in every avenue. So don't lose your faith and have faith. Now it's up to you to take on, um, you know, this situation where you are going to be the one who's going to make the, um, the choices. You are the one that, um, 
you need to be the one to take the action. But there is something they are advising here. They are saying advice. Perhaps professional advice is needed in, in a matter. You need professional advice, yes. You need professional advice, especially in regard to money, maybe. In regard to a big sum of money connected to something that you love. Okay, money, something you love. Connected to number two, perhaps. Number 11 there also. Someone born in November. Someone born in uh, in February, maybe. Well, number two is there. It could be for two people, a couple. Anyway. Uh, the point is, what I'm trying to create, there's a torch here and there is money coming, um, a support, big money is coming to you. Uh, wealth is there for you. So you, maybe it's in regard to that you need uh, advice, professional advice, or it could be in regard to something else. You will be meeting someone very hardworking, someone that's very hard work. They work hard, they're reliable, they're gentle. And you are going to enjoy and love the qualities within them. This person could be of Earth energy, Virgo, Taurus, or Capricorn, either one. I feel like this person is very optimistic and they are going to be uh, quite helpful towards you. They have a beautiful sense of uh, loyalty, honesty, and a little bit of sense of humor. Not much of a sense of humor, but they think very deeply and they're very trustworthy. So um, this person is very down to Earth, being an Earth energy have a lot of earth in them and you will have uh this person will have a great effect in your life they are going to support you and uplift you which is wonderful you're navigating your life you're you're navigating through life and you need to follow your bliss and bliss is coming towards you there's so much blessings coming you're also traveling lightly some of you could be going on a short trip guys did see the trip here actually it was right there there's the trip so it shows that you are going on a trip and it's a short one, not a very long one. It could be going with someone or to meet someone. But what's amazing? What is that? I'm trying to see it close up. Yes, it is to do with a connection. It's either family or someone that you care about. But there is a short trip without a doubt. So now back to where I was, which I was here. Oh, yeah, I was really nearly to the end. Okay. So, um... I see that you have got many options before you and you need to make a choice. I can see that. The choice is not easy. You need to be very realistic. You need to be patient and you need to have your faith and not to lose it. Believe that you are going to be guided. Your higher self is going to be there. But they're telling you it's okay to go ahead, take action. You are going to take action. And this action is your movement. You're actually moving somewhere or you're leaving something behind. You're leaving a place with regret. You're leaving someone with regret. You're leaving a situation regrettably and unhappy. But this uh, change is going to make you grow. There's a lot of growth. Even though you're, you might have been decisive before, but now something has happened that's made you look towards this change. Look carefully, think carefully before you make your decision, before you make the final decision. Um, I feel like you may be feeling a little bit alone, maybe that's why. But I feel like uh, this decision is imminent and it's destined. You are about to meet someone very faithful, someone very loyal. Again, uh, I saw that before and now again. They're showing me that, that twice so that you understand. You are not going to be alone. You are going to be with someone who has... Uh, who has a lot of qualities within them. You will love these quality qual qualities and they're very, very strong. This person is going to fulfill you in every way. This could be a friend. This could be a friend that might turn to be a lover later on. But there is someone wonderful uh, here. Someone wonderful. Um, that is going to help you. Emotional fulfillment, um, goals achieved, and the rewards are all to do with this person. That is going to be... Um, going to be one of the wishes one of your wishes granted to have met someone like this so you are meeting someone wonderful this person could be your hero this good person um you know they are really into you and they're really really um i, I see cupid here sort of blowing all these um love hearts sort of um instead of um the arrow they look like love hearts so i do see something incredible here happening with someone uh take a chance on love i know you might be afraid but you don't need to be there is someone incredible this person is really wonderful and they want to act on their feelings for you i see yeah very strong earth energy taurus even i'm seeing a taurus here 
there is a Thor, uh, what do you call it, a, a, a bull. Taurus, very, very strong in this person. So they've got earth energy, which you will love and and um, that's going to go well with you. But there's two double fish here. So they've got double Pisces. They've got Pisces in them. It doesn't necessarily mean that they've got double Pisces. It just means the Pisces in them is very strong. Um, I also see one scorpion. So two fish. Two double fish because the, the the Pisces is two fish, so there's double double two, but one scorpion. So they do have water energy in them, very strong. But the universe and our guiding angels here are nominating what they are. There's a lot of Pisces, which makes them very deep and very caring, very romantic. Uh, Scorpio, very analytical, very much into you. And then there are two lions. Wow! Now the two lions. That's that's that is um, Leo. Leo very strong so they're very nurturing and you will love that about them they've got Leo in them very strong I also see one uh, archer one Sagittarius but there are two lions so that would make them very uh what's the word attractive um, into you very loving very powerful and i'm seeing wow chinese year of the pig one big pig and two pigs three pigs one two three pigs oh my god so this person has got they, they could be um born under the chinese year of the pig because i'm seeing one two three pigs chinese year of the pig big time now there is also someone here that looks like um ox chinese year of the ox twice i've got the letter y here for yes but there is also the two oxes chinese here of the buffalo or ox there could be also could be yourself and then i'm seeing um right next to the ox there is two monkeys chinese here of the monkeys so this could be either you or the person don't forget there are millions of millions of liberals so each liberal will be connecting to some uh, you know this could be your chinese here or theirs i see two rats and i see uh, two cats at the same time chinese here of the rat chinese here of the cat also here very strong and finally there's one dog and one snake Chinese here of the dog or the snake so this could be either yourself or the person I think the ones that are doubled up uh, could be um, the person but it doesn't necessarily you know it could be you could be born the Chinese here of the rabbit and there's two rabbits or you could be born the Chinese here of the monkey and there are two monkeys but the rabbit will go well with the monkey and um, the buffalo also so that's wonderful but the most important one that unites everybody and goes well with everyone is the pig chinese zero the pig big time because that was shown three times so pay attention to that and then now finally i'm going to go through I, f I feel like there's going to be a lot of happiness here coming your way like you are going to be absolutely wishes granted a lot of your wishes are going to be granted and among that one particular wish is that this person that you are going to be uniting with and moving in your life with them now i'm going to go through and read everything that's being given to me now um, first and foremost, it says you will be given an incredible gift of a lifetime. Uh, you will be given an incredible gift. And then I was given the gift of a lifetime. So it's going to be a gift that you will treasure and have for a whole lifetime. Now that could be, now that could be someone magnificent that you will spend the rest of your life with this person that I was saying that you will be so much, uh, you know, um, so much in love with or someone that you will connect with on a very high level. That, or it could be money because I got money, big amount of money. So the gift could be money also. You see that I nominated because I was, and I did see uh, after the two nuggets, uh, the gift of money there too but you are going to have peace of mind that is the most that the third gift so among these incredible gifts maybe they're not one gift there's a gift of a lifetime there's a gift of money and there's a gift of peace of mind the third one peace of mind and that is a beautiful gift also timing is everything everything they didn't tell me timing is now i was told timing is everything but when i was looking at your cup they were saying timing is now for you to take action maybe to take action look at your money reading have a look at your lucky numbers use them and buy a lottery ticket every now and then try to do it every month if you can and don't spend too much money five ten dollars you don't need to do more and just uh, be part of it on a regular basis like even if it's every month so it doesn't affect your budget at all now there is something about a book or a story that's been um, on your mind or you've been dealing with and thinking about or, you know, going through. There is a story or a book that will touch your heart. Or you could be writing a book 
uh, your biography. That is a possibility. Someone really wants you. They could want you for um, a relationship because they think, you know, there's so many beautiful things in you that they love and admire. Or someone wants you for a position. Maybe they will offer you a job position. You are, and oh, somebody could want you for um, a story. You know, it could be uh, someone who's an extra somewhere, or you could be an actress, or it could be someone that is needed. Somebody wants you. There is a mystery. Um, a mystery that is going to be quite puzzling for you. Now, there is a situation where you feel that you are betrayed. Maybe there is a betray betrayal. There is a situation of a couple, a couple, like two people. Uh, so you've just got to be careful that, that. It could be connected at a time where it was Christmas time, because I see December, and I was shown the Christmas bowls as a vision, so I, I connected December and Christmas time. So there could be a betrayal with a couple, like a, you know, um, a spa two spouses, two people. That could be. So be very uh, vigilant and be very careful. And this could happen at Christmas time, so be careful. Okay, something is needed in your body, and I'm shown garlic. I was given to tell you that you need garlic, garlic big time. Uh, garlic is very important. It's like you need it. Your body needs it. And um, perhaps it is a, a must to really look into taking garlic. Or even if you can't take the actual garlic itself, uh, try to increase your garlic in your food intake when you're cooking. And also perhaps look into supplements. Garlic is needed. That's what the guardian angels are saying. Now, uh, something about owning your own business. Some of you are thinking of owning your business. Some of you already do own your own business. And some of you are working towards owning your business. And you will, and you will do well. You will be quite successful. Now, um, okay. Now the letters that I was given. I was given uh, not many letters, which is really amazing. It was very short. I was given O for Olympics. I was given twice the letter S for Sweden, and I was given the letter A twice again for Alaska. So Olympics, olive, and then we've got S for sweet or Sweden, A for apple or ants, um, Antarctica. Uh, these were given to me twice. So uh, very important, these letters. And um, shout out to people with these names. Uh, these uh, could be also the names of the person that you're destined, you know, the initial of one of these could be the initial of the person you're destined to be with. I was given three numbers. I'll start with the first one, which was six. Six is about healing from love, healing because of love. It is connected to the Chinese year of the snake. And there was one snake here. It is also connected to the Chinese, uh, not the Chinese year of the snake, we said that, uh, in, to June, the month of June, which is someone who is either a Gemini or a Cancer. So June. Um, also, it is connected to love and peace. Then I was given, uh, okay, so from the time you see this up to, I'm, I'm choking, I've got to drink some water. Yes, I'm sorry about that. Uh, Six is also connected to peace, peace of mind, healing. So um, from the time you see this cup up to six, up to June, there's going to be a lot of healing, a lot of loving, healing because of love, spirituality, and being touched by love somehow. So you might be meeting the person from now to June. Then we've got um, number four. Number four is connected to this year, the Chinese year of the rabbit. This is the year of the rabbit. It is all about quick success. Those of you who are born in the Chinese year of the rabbit or meeting someone, and we had two rabbits in the cup, Chinese year of the rabbit, we had one snake, but two Chinese year of the rabbit. Uh, if it's yourself or someone that you're meeting, this year is going to bring you very quick success. And it's starting from the time this coffee, you see this coffee up to four months from now. So four is also connected to April. People born in April are Taurus. Remember I said Taurus and also Aries. But Taurus was shown in your cup, not Aries. Now, we have also number five. Uh, so yes, uh, from the time you see this up to four months, quick success is coming to you in many areas of your life. Finally, we have number five, all about changes and transformations that is going to change. A lot of changes you're going to go through from now, from now up to five months. And the five is connected to Chinese year of the dragon. Uh, the five is also connected to um people born in may taurus again remember we had taurus and that person who was earth energy they had a lot of taurus um taurus and also may is um, gemini so um gemini and taurus uh, seem to be rep doubled up in these uh, numbers five is about transformations and changes that you'll go through from the time you see this cup up to may 
or up to five months from this time. Keep on the lookout for everything that's happening. Know that you are cherished by the universe, cherished by your guardian angels more than the universe and more than anything. And, and also remember the incredible gift of a lifetime, one which is going to be the person that is going to be uh, uniting with you, the money that's coming and the peace of mind. Three amazing gifts. And with those three gifts, I wish you abundance of blessings and joy. Don't forget to give me a thumbs up if you enjoyed this video. Always subscribe and um, click on the bell for notification. And let me know what you think. I look forward to hearing from you. Blessings and lots of love and light. Namaste.